greetings and welcome back everybody to a new video so it's been a while since i've made a video about the tab s5 e so i thought i'd make a video and show you guys an awesome feature on this tablet that can extend the lifespan of the battery which is inside your tablet so before we begin if you guys are new here and if you guys enjoy all the content that i create do make sure to hit that subscribe button and then hit the bell icon and select all to get notifications for my latest uploads and do make sure to follow me on instagram i do post a lot of content over here all the links are in the video description all right so let us start now we all know that lithium ion batteries do have finite number of charge and discharge cycles and eventually they will wear out and stop holding charge and you will have to replace them sooner or later but there is a feature on this tablet called battery protect that i think you should turn on because that feature will extend the lifespan of the battery now unfortunately this feature is not yet available on samsung smartphones but i hope to see it in the near future and if Samsung does decide to add this feature to the smartphones, you will see a video on my channel. So drop down the notification panel, go to settings, scroll down here to the part which says device care, then tap on battery. And then tap on these three dots and then go to settings. And scroll down here and turn on this feature which says protect battery. To extend the lifespan of your battery, limit the maximum charge to 85%. Note that after you restart, the battery will show 100% when it is charged to 85%. So right now this feature is turned on, the tablet is plugged in and the battery meter is showing 100%. But in reality, the battery is only charged up to 85%. So there is still 15% capacity remaining. And one thing you guys should know about lithium ion batteries is that they don't like being fully charged all the time so if you leave your tablet or your phone plugged in into the charger all the time with the battery level sitting at 100% and if you don't have this feature you might end up with a battery that looks somewhat like this so this is the battery from my previous tablet the Acer Iconia W4 this tablet used to be plugged in pretty much all the time it's a Windows 10 tablet so the battery kind of got swollen up and it does not hold charge anymore so yeah that is the end of that and this feature will potentially prevent the battery from blowing up like that because the battery is not charging up to 100%. And also, you should not drain your battery all the way down to 10%. Always recharge the battery on your phone and on your tablet when the battery level is around 25 to 30%. So 25 to 30% all the way up to 85%, that is the sweet spot. But hey, if you wanna go out somewhere, then do recharge it fully doesn't really matter because it's not going to stay at 100% all the time. But if you are someone who watches Netflix or plays a lot of games on your tablet, so I do watch a lot of Netflix, I watch YouTube, I just leave my tablet plugged in all the time so the battery is at 100%. But with this feature turned on, the charge level is limited to 85% and because the tablet is plugged in whenever I'm watching movies on Netflix or watching YouTube, the battery does not go through charge and discharge cycles, it stays at 85% and that will potentially prevent the battery from degrading quickly. Okay, so a quick recap, if you want a really good lifespan out of your lithium ion batteries in your devices, number one, recharge them when the battery level is around 25 to 30% and always unplug your devices when the charge level is around 85 to 90%. I would say unplug it around 85% unless you are going out. So if you're going out, it's good to recharge to 100% because it's not gonna stay at 100% when you are actually using your device. And number two, keep your phone and your tablet cool. That is quite essential because the lithium ion batteries, again, they don't like a lot of heat and the cooler you keep your devices, especially when they are charging, the longer the battery is going to last and don't leave your phone or your tablet inside your car especially during the daytime because the temperature inside your car will go well above 50 degrees celsius especially if you're living in a tropical country and that is pretty much all you need to do the best example of uh, battery longevity I have is this little Nokia phone. This is the Nokia 6510. This phone is 18 years old. It still has the original battery. So this is the original battery that the phone came with and yes this battery still holds charge and the phone works just fine. So yeah this phone was well taken care of the battery was never allowed to reach 0% and we always unplug the phone before it was fully charged. So yes 
if you take care of the lithium ion battery in your devices the battery is going to last a really long time and if you have the tab s5e do make sure that you turn on the protect battery feature you can just leave your tablet plugged in when you're watching netflix or watching youtube so guys that pretty much brings us to the end of this video bottom line is if you take care of the battery inside your devices the battery will last a very long time and here's another example this is a 10 year old phone this is the samsung omnia pro and this one still has the original battery the battery holds charge just fine it was well taken care of so guys thank you for watching do stay tuned for more videos like these and if you have any questions feel free to hit them in the comment section down below and i'll try and answer them so thank you for watching do stay tuned for more videos like these and i will see you guys next time